M-A at work! Ah. Uh, a number two with no pickles, no tomato, with a Dr. Pepper. That sounds it. delicious. Well, we got to find out where he's at first. That's true. I'm a Chick-fil-A. My wife loves Chick-fil-A. <laughs> uh, I had Chick Fil A for lunch today, spicy chicken sandwich. I, I am not able. I'm not. I'm not allowed to eat bread or uh, anything of the sort right now. So <laughs> it's delicious. You know, it is very delicious. And then I look across the street, and there's an In and Out, and then you know, there's a McDonald's. Like, I, I love food so much. You know, and then like I look at the good. Stuff. There's a Morton's, a Ruth Chris. There's uh, Maggiano's. There's so many good restaurants over here. Sushi. Uh, I can, I can eat sushi. I just can't eat rice, I guess. I don't really, the only thing I pay attention to is Animal Planet and my daughter. I like, movie, you know, movies. I'm a, I'm a movie buff. And my wife. My wife, my wife, my wife I, I don't mention my wife, but she's she's my, my right hand. She always does the same stuff I do. Oh, my God. Oh, man. We could just what? do movie hour with Ian McCall, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I, so, would, uh, I would love to be a movie buff. <laughs> The next Roger Ebert, whenever you retire yeah, from fighting. I'll, yeah, I'll just I'll just be a movie critic. I, I want to I don't I just, I don't want to just critique movies. Though. I want to critique everything, like from food to cars to movies to people in general. Like I I want to just TV show where I can just critique things and just basically talk shit because it would be fun. So with the uh, the upcoming card, the uh, UFC on FX two, you know who. I mean, who will you be rooting for anybody in the uh, the Benavidez Rujatani fight, or is there one that you'd rather fight than the other? Whenever you beat uh, Demetrius Johnson. Well, I I don't know your Shatani, obviously, but I, I know Joe. Joe's a cool guy. I always, you know, been friendly with Joe. Um, as far as how I feel, I want the Japanese to win because just to bring relevance. To, to the weight class. Like, oh, we were good the whole time. You know, uh, we, we belonged here the whole time. Do I think he's going to win? And personally, I like Joe, so obviously I want Joe to win. Um, I'd love to fight Joe. I'd love to fight either one of them. But I, 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 think, I think Joe's the better fighter anyway, so I think, I think I'll definitely see him in the finals. So yeah. I, I was going to say, you know, with um, – you're talking about them bringing relevance, you know, showing that oh, – what what should we expect? You know the the people who don't really know the flyweight class, the people who t- pay attention mainly to the UFC and Bellator and Strikeforce. Should they? I mean, should we be expecting a huge flood of of you know high class flyweights coming into the UFC soon? Uh, there's a lot of talent. You know, you got to look at guys like myself, Yuri Shatani, Joe Demetrius, and you have John Dodson, uh, Louis Galdino. Um, I mean, he, he, there's a couple of Brazilians, John Lineker, just here in the Silva. I mean, these guys are legitimate fighters. They're very good. They're technically, I mean, I think we're technically better than all the bigger guys. You know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. You know, in the, the wise words of Pee Wee Herman, uh, I, I, I think that we're going to have, we're going to put on a show. People are going to love it because they're going to see that we're even faster and even more exciting than, than, than the other way. And that's, at least myself, and I know that John John Dawson can do it. Benavides can do it. We can put people away. You know, we're going to be knocking people out. 